terrifying ordeal of Frank Sinatra Jr. began while he was filling an engagement at Lake Tahoe. He was on the bill at the Hora Casino, and there was no shadow of the impending crime as he held the floor at an earlier performance. The young man was following in the footsteps of his father. The eldest Sinatra was the idol of Bobby Soxers in the 30s. While he was fulfilling his engagement at the resort on the California-Nevada state line, young Frank was staying at this motel annex. He was having dinner before one of his shows when his abductors moved in. An FBI padlock seals the door of his room as clues are sought. A trumpet player, John Foss, was with Sinatra when the two armed gunmen spirited him away. Foss was able to give the authorities little help as police set up roadblocks within 15 minutes. The kidnappers, however, slipped the net and drove their victim to Los Angeles 400 miles away. They forced Sinatra to make the trip hidden in the trunk compartment. The elder Sinatra received eight phone calls with instructions on ransom payments. And in the early morning hours, more than two days later, was able to announce his son's return. Young Sinatra had been released a few miles from home as others of the gang picked up the ransom money. He had a long rest at his mother's house after nearly three days with little sleep. It was another ordeal as he faced reporters' questions. I was scared. I was a little bit nervous, naturally, but uh, the only thing I could do was hope for the best. What Frank, right you know was Frank, was confident that it turned out all right Frank? Over here. We right. just prayed that and it I would. Just, uh, I uh, just hope. Mr. Sinatra, yes, sir. when was the first time that you talked with Frank? Was it when he was brought home, or did he talk to you on the phone beforehand? When he was brought home. When did you first know he was safe? When did you I learn? never knew that he was safe yeah, until I saw him. How do you feel now? How do you feel now, Mr. Just Sinatra? Just beautiful, thank you. And may we be excused. When will you go back to work, Frank? Did you talk them out of it at all? While we don't know that. Uh, We're keeping sorry, him home sir, for a while. I'm not at liberty to release that Mr. information. Mr. Sinatra. Yeah. Fellas, Frank, do you mind if we go now? Because I want right. to meet him. Okay, honey. Give her a big kiss, why don't you? <laughs> <laughs> wait a minute, Joe. Wait a minute. 